Are you sick of running out of data because Arc is taking up all your space with mods? Well, this is a video on how to properly uninstall mods from Steam. This is a topic that's quite close to my heart. I, it pees me off how much room mods take up and how annoying they are to uninstall. So the, the standard method for most people would be go to Workshop, find your mod either by searching for it or go and browse subscribed items and unsubscribing from the item. That's all good and proper, but it doesn't actually delete that folder from your mod mods folder it just disappears on steam it doesn't actually delete the file so you're still there with all this data as you can see i've currently had 263 gigs in arc i mean there's not much i could do about that but what we're going to do today is show you how to properly uninstall your mods from arc now what i tend to do is you go to arc workshop go to browse and then subscribed items from there you can see what items you are subscribed to and there's a few pages so i'm going to click on safe waters i've done this for a mod review i'm going to want to install it so i'm actually going to open that up i'm not going to just click on subscribe i'm going to hit my scroll button on the mouse which is going to open it up in a new tab so i don't lose the window behind it i'm going to scroll down and we're going to make note of the mod id then what we're going to do is from there we're going to navigate file explorer go to where you'll save your games so i've got a second ssd games steam and then you're going to go steam app Apps, common, arc, shooter game, content, mods. Okay, and just for reference, this is how much data we've got just in the mods folder. 13 gigs in the mods folder. A little bit annoying. So we're going to click on mods, and then we're going to find that number that corresponds with the one that we want to unsubscribe from. So what I'm going to do right now is because I've got this page open, I'm going to click unsubscribe, so they would no longer subscribe to that. And we're going to find the last four digits of this. So it's 774. Now you can just search it here, but I'm going to just scroll down i don't have too many mods at the moment 7748 so 236 236 that is the one okay we're just gonna right click and delete and there should be another mod down here this file isn't too big it's only a kilobyte but just for the keeping it all neat there we go that one and we're gonna delete now we deleted that mod so we're gonna close that out i'm gonna go to the next one uh dino pickup mod i was doing that for a mod review or for an example so i don't actually want that one so we're gonna unsubscribe from it we're gonna find the mod id it ends in 9781 did it start with 8707 it does okay so we're gonna delete that and find it up here right click delete done got rid of that one we can close that so if you refresh this page by clicking back up there and then just going back to subscribe to items you can see that they've gone and now they've actually been removed i mean i think that's it for now i do keep my mod folder pretty clean but before we had about 70 gigs in the mod folder which i could not deal with so that's how you properly delete your mods from your mod folder now i don't think the two that we deleted is really going to take much size off of this 13.1 gig yeah it didn't take too much off but that is how you delete mods properly so if your mod folder is huge it's going to take you a little while but it's going to be worth it you're going to save so much space anyways that's the video thank you for watching hope you enjoyed if you did make sure you like button subscribe to community and i'll see you in the next one have a fantastic day